Hi, I'm Dr. Egan from Now Hear This, and today I want to talk to you a little bit about the Bose self-fitting hearing aids. So we've had a lot of questions about this and we did a thorough investigation. Um, all the staff at our clinic went and tried a set of the Bose sound control hearing aids. They are the first FDA cleared uh, hearing aid that you can self fit, meaning you can just buy them online, which is exciting. If there is someone who's the right fit for this, this makes hearing aids so much more accessible and affordable. It is only for people who have a mild to moderate hearing loss. And here's our review. So the first thing that I noticed is the Bose hearing aids came with a very easy to understand and use manual. It goes through all the different tips of making sure it's fitting your ears well, connecting to the hearing aids, all those good things. And this was very user friendly to me, as well as some of the other members of our staff. Uh, that being said, connecting the hearing aids to the app I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that too well here. The app is able to adjust the world volume and then the bass and treble. So it's very basic, but you can drag and slide this volume here up and down to give you more or less bass, more or less treble, and more or less of a general volume boost. And that was very simple and intuitive to figure out. So that was great to see. Um, those were my first initial impressions in the pro column. Uh, I do have a couple cons that I'm gonna go over next. The big one that I first noticed, this is the hearing aid itself is the wire. It only comes with one size wire and if you've ever seen an audiologist before, you know that no two ears are alike. There is always a wide variety of wires that someone might need in order to fit their ear. Um, the only way to switch the wire size out is to order a different size from the company and have it shipped to your house. They also recommend in the manual to have the wire si the wires replaced each year, which in our field, really you only need to do these things as needed. So I'm not really sure why they're so worried about the wire breaking down, but one of our staff members actually found the wire length uncomfortable because she needed something a little smaller. And so if you have a little bit more petite ears or larger ears, you might struggle finding the physical fit for the hearing aid to be just right. The other surprising thing about these hearing aids is their bows. I assumed that if they connected to an app on your phone, they'd be able to stream, but that was not the case. The app is the only thing the hearing aid connects to, and you aren't able to stream phone calls, podcasts, or music, all those other things that even very basic, affordable hearing aids offer, you can't stream at this point. And lastly, I was surprised about the warranty. It gives you an extended warranty of only one ear when pretty much all other hearing aids elsewhere, you're able to at least get a two or three year warranty. And with that, the warranty doesn't cover loss and damage. So if you lose these, you're out of luck. Uh, in general, I would say these could be a great fit for someone who has a very mild hearing loss that is purely age related and a very mild slope on the audiogram. If someone has a history of noise exposure, like loud sounds, rock concerts, construction, or if they have a history of vascular concerns like diabetes, you know, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, those are gonna impact their hearing loss in ways that it would be difficult to use that app to really navigate and make things the right fit. So in general, I would say, yes, this could be a great product for some folks, but the important thing is that they have their hearing tested by an audiologist first so that we really understand, you know, where do we need to go from here? What over-the-counter hearing aid like Bose is gonna help me best? And that's our plan here at Now Hear This. We are currently working through the different over-the-counter and self-fitting options out there so that we can give patients more guidance in this very complex and changing field.